thanks SoCal Student Support Team for um, inviting me to the Fall 2021 orientation. Um, my name is Cindy Joe, working at the Office of International Programs and Services, supporting PCSPP's international students and managing our wonderful study abroad programs. Um, we started our very first faculty-led short-term study abroad programs in 2008. Um, in more than 10 years, we have had more than 1,100 students um, travel to about 44 countries and regions on almost every continent. And between students and the faculty, PSSPP has contributed more than 700 service learning hours to our um, to the uh, communities we have visited. These programs have opened our students' eyes to a totally different world of cultures, traditions, and practices in psychology. Um, give you some examples, like one of the program to South Africa, um, students examine uh, cross-disciplinary interventions for issues like uh, teen pregnancy, youth violence, uh, racism, drug abuse, public health, um, organizational policies, human rights, and education. Um, for the program to India, students observe the specific nuances of the world of work and reflect on how that differs from organizations at home. Um, in the program in Zambia, students implemented a train the trainer curriculum and worked with the safe park staff on providing mental health counseling to children in this orphanage. Um, a student went back to the community um, after collecting some donations from TSSPP and through these street kids, their very first birthday party. Um, students went to Switzerland to visit Young's Institute and had a chance to see all the valuable archives and participated in seminars um, at the world very famous institution and International School of uh, um, Analytic Psychology. In Germany, a group of forensic students from DC campus had a chance to examine the role of correctional counselors the assessment and the classifications of the criminal offenders and effective strategies and challenges in correctional treatment in Germany. Um, some students returned as an agent of change to re-examine the system we have here in the United States that is not working well. And in Japan, the group visited a variety of schools, clinics, and hospitals to learn different approaches to psychological issues and learn a different cultural context. Um, before I get into the process of TSSPP study abroad programs, I want to just briefly to share the findings of IIE's survey of study abroad alumni. IIE stands for Institute of International Education, a division of Department of State. They surveyed more than 4,500 alumni who studied abroad between 1999 and 2000, and again, to the, um, 2016 and 2017. Majority said that studying abroad has equipped the skills that their employers look for. Um, it really aligns with the survey they have done with employers uh, very well. Employers look for more of these skills um, you can see it on the screen, that they think students participated in the study abroad program will equip for like an equip at a higher level. It, it uh, um, obviously increases the, the student's employability. And now um, let's explore a little bit more about how our study abroad program run and how it works for you. Uh, PCSPP's study abroad program stand out with three very unique uh, characteristics, faculty-led, short-term, and aid available if you're eligible. Um, let's expand each of this a little bit more in the next few slides. All our study abroad programs at TCSPP are um, created and led by our own faculty. So I always like to call Call them made in house and organic product of TSSPP. It is related to faculty's research and studies of current issues. Um, these programs are all developed at the graduate level 
Um, we are also working with the BA department um, to have a program for BA students, but you are um, welcome to join many of these programs as well. Um, majority of, of the courses are three credit hours, but sometimes a two credit course might be proposed. And most departments will allow you to apply one study abroad course towards your degree requirement, which is very critical that I will explain a little later. So all the study abroad programs are credit bearing. Um, the second uniqueness is um, the travel is short term. We call that short term study abroad. We created our study abroad programs with the consideration of our population. Most of our students are professionals with employment and some have families, it is hard for them to leave these behind, um, leave these behind for too long. So our study courses are like any other courses in TCSPP. You take the course during the semester on ground or online, depends on the offering faculty, and travel during the school break. Maximum travel time are uh, travel time is 10 to 15 days. So it is a little bit easier for you to uh, make arrangements with your employers um, or your families as well. And very critical, very important financial aid is available if you are eligible. Um, it's a very critical for many students to participate in the study abroad program. If your department approves that you can apply the study abroad course towards your degree requirement, most likely you will be eligible for aid and the supplemental aid to support your travel. Um, I will talk about the supplemental aid a little bit more later on. You will use the course substitution form to discuss with your department whether you can apply the course towards one of your uh, required courses or electives. There's no special rules for study abroad course, um, but follow the same aid policy. Um, it does impact your total aid package if you're eligible. So please discuss with your aid advisor as early as possible so you have a better idea when you submit your application. Let's take a look at the financial part of the study block course. It's very um, important um, to know. Once you are registered for a study block course, you will be responsible for the tuition, program fee, airfare, um, and some miscellaneous expenses on passport, for example, visa if needed, special immunization and vaccines your doctor recommended. Um, others can include a, um, activation of the international call on your cell phone, travel insurance with your airline, and now very, very important um, COVID-19 test when you return to the United States after the program, which is required by our government right now. The tuition will be the same for you as you pay for other courses. Um, the program fee usually covers in-country lodging during the period of the program, some local transportation, some meals. Um, each program is different. Um, so um, we, we say some local transportation and some meals. Um, and all scheduled program activities, events, visits, speakers, and the corporate excursion and emissions, uh, tickets, everything that is covered as long as the, the activity is in, on the itinerary. And also it includes supplemental travel health insurance, which includes emergency and evacuation. And no payment is needed in advance. Once we register you, the, the fee is going to be filled with the course and you will see um, on your student uh, account. But you only pay when you, you pay your tuition, so same schedule. Just be aware of that program fee is not refundable after the last day of adjunct for each semester, usually the first Sunday after the semester starts. Um, online term two courses, for example, if your study abroad course is an online term two course, um, it will follow the term one calendar or on ground calendar for preparation purpose. Um, so see what the supplemental aid can do for you. Uh, let's take a look. Um, if you are eligible, your tuition will be covered by the standard aid, like for other courses that you take at TSSPP. The supplemental aid will cover 
100% of the program fee, um, up to $2,000 of airfare, and maximum $1,000 for we increase the cost, um, the coverage to $1,000 from $700 to cover COVID related issues. So maximum $1,000 for miscellaneous expenses, like I mentioned earlier. Study abroad is expensive, I have to be honest, but we do have this aid available to support the investment on your professional development. And now let's take a look at the application process. It's, uh, it's pretty easy. Um, application is online. You will see the link in many places once we announce the program. Um, in order to prepare students and the faculty, we use on-ground calendar for administrative purpose. Um, there is a round decision deadline. That's what we call that round decision deadline for each semester. It is always the Friday before the semester starts. By that date, the program must have minimum eight students enrolled before proceeding. This is to have a, a reasonable cost for participants. For, um, for uh, spring programs, it's going to be um, in sometimes in the first week of January. Um, and um, I think it's January 7th. Um, when you apply, you will find the, the course substitution form link in the form that you can download and complete before you discuss about your course with, uh, with your department and the, um, your eligibility for aid with your aid advisor. Um, applications closes on the first Friday, uh, the Friday of the first week if the program proceeds. Um, so we will, at that time, we will keep you very closely posted on the progress of each um, timeline. Oops, did I, uh, um, okay, so once we, we receive your application, there are two reviews. My office will conduct an administrative review, including your academic standing. We require minimum 3.0 uh, cumulative G GPA. Um, and But if you decide to study abroad in the first semester when you do not have a um, GPA yet, that's okay. We will work with you case by case. Um, we also review your holding re hold record to make sure that you don't have any academic hold or financial hold with TSSPP. However, if you do uh, have one when you submit your application, we will let you know there is a hold and give you time to work uh, with your advisors to have the hold released. Um, some holes are very minor that might be overlooked uh, at your admission stage. Um, if the program started a waiting list, we will let you know and give you a little bit a deadline to resolve the hole. We want to give all the students a fair chance to participate. Um, also, we will make sure that there is no SEC hearing pending. Um, your school status must be active. This is solely due to our administrative capacity reason. Um, we always have alumni or student at large who want to participate, but we don't have um, the capacity to support, uh, which is um, definitely need a totally, you know, they need a total different set of policies and the process. Um, faculty will require either an essay or interview or both to review your, um, your eligibility. It is to make sure that you have reviewed the information about the program and have a better understanding about the course. Um, my office will register you once your final qualification is determined and it will send you a confirmation. So you don't register any study for a course for yourself. Um, so let's see um, why an early planning on special accommodation is so important when study abroad. Um, different countries have a different capacity for special accommodations and the government has different policies and guidelines to ensure that students with special needs can enjoy the program as the same as their cohort. It takes much, much longer time when discussed with our in-country contractors and the service providers, especially when, we, um, when the need is a, is, a, is a special equipment or personnel. Um, in addition, for, for example, three to four city blocks every day is interpreted as intensive walking for us in the United States. 20,000 20, steps each day in Japan is called normal. So some prescription pain relievers, you know, relief medicines is legal here, but illegal in Europe. So um, 
we will um, please let us know as early as you submit the application so we can um, start the research for you to make sure you can be accommodated or you will have more time to work with your um, related doc doctors or, or um, partners or, or um, faculty for some other options. Um, so that's something always, um, okay. So you may find all the information I talked about on the TCSPP community website, um, community at the Chicago, uh, the Chicago school .edu. Uh, We are under Campus Live here, right here, and you will see international programs. Um, otherwise, you always can email us at the study abroad at the Chicago school .edu, um, if you have any questions or you have a hard time to find anything. Okay, so um, COVID-19 definitely stopped our travel. We suspended all the travel since um, spring, um, fall 20. Um, and, but it won't definitely won't stop our continuous commitment to offering international learning experiences to our students. Um, we continued with our annual study broad proposal collection um, and we'll announce programs soon for summer 22, fall 22 and spring 23. Most programs are offered to all campuses, either as an online course or through Zoom meetings. Um, in spring 2022, we are um, heading to eight countries. As you can see, I'm not going to read every, um, every program to you. Um, I especially want to introduce you to the program to Switzerland led by Dr. Bacon, uh, our very own um, faculty at MCFT department. Uh, in Anaheim campus. Um, so many of you might be studying with, with that department. The program is open to all students. Um, spring 2022 will be the fifth year for Dr. Bacon to lead this program. Um, the study is focused on spirituality and addictions. Um, if you cannot join this year, that's okay. I'm sure Dr. Bacon will uh, propose again for spring 2023. Um, so um, get ready and plan ahead. Um, that's all from me. Thank you very much. Um, I'm not going to play the video since Zoom doesn't make it sound well, um, but you will be able to access from our website and definitely I will share with student support team so they can play for you on the screen um, or you can access in a separate place. So thank you so much. Um, and again, welcome to TCSPP. If you have any questions, again, feel free to email to studybroad at the Chicago School.edu. Um, I look forward to uh, working with you for any of the study abroad programs. Thank you. And again, welcome to TCSPP.